everyone welcome back to the channel it's been a while since I've had a video over the last month I have just been um, doing uh, regular pairings with the breeding uh, repeating them with the ball pythons and just uh, taking care of the snakes taking care of the rats and working a full-time job and I have missed uh, you guys I, I've missed uh, making a video so without further ado here we are uh, I want to give you an update on the building uh, that I have for my rat shack and uh, it's coming along and we're almost ready to move in there um, so special thanks to performance construction Doug Stedman for helping me out with that and so you might be wondering what am I pairing up so that's what I'm going to show you today guys I want to show you uh, what I'm pairing up and we have Ramondu he is an orange dream mystic spider and he is with orange dream vanilla her name is Rhiannon and they have been locking up now I just put all these males in here today so just a few minutes ago so no one's locked up just yet but um, so that'll be a nice pairing so and hopefully a nice result from that so orange dream mystic spider to orange dream vanilla female next I have uh, my black pastel hypo female her name is midnight and she is a big girl and I have in there with her chronos he is a butter inchy chocolate he's a double hit for desert ghost and hypo so both of them are hit for hypo so I'm thinking I can have some pretty cool hypo stuff, guys. So hypo is hypo pigmentation. Uh, it is also referred to as ghost. Um, and there is another morph, not to be confused with, true ghost. So I prefer hypo just to differentiate. Uh, but anyway, it's going to be really cool. Hopefully... Uh, We'll get a clutch out of these guys. All right, moving along. Freya, she's a super blade inchy head clown. She is in there. Uh, Thor has joined her. He is a pastel leopard lesser head clown. He has been a stud. He has been locking up with these girls. Uh, this little guy knows what to do. So I'm excited to see uh, what can happen here. Callisto is a pastel clown. And Thor has been logging with her quite frequently. She is off feed, and so I'm hoping she might think about ovulation and things like that. So here is uh, Artemis, my special. Uh, she is het for clown, and I put in there with her Spartan. He is a clown, so a special clown would be fabulous all right my banana her name is Persephone and I have Draxus in there with her Draxus is a leopard hurricane from Hans Winter in Germany he was the world's first of his kind and I was able to talk Hans into selling him to me so and there you see my beautiful banana Persephone, she's sticking her head out there to say hello. Uh, they have been locking up on a regular basis. So some beautiful babies can result from this. Leopard hurricane, banana, so forth. Uh, really cool. Petra is a super stripe. She's a, a big girl. And Draxus, the leopard hurricane, has been going to her. This pairing has never been done before. So what I'm hoping to have is some world first specter hurricanes, uh, leopard specter hurricane, so forth and so on. Maybe leopard, maybe leopard specter hurricane yellow belly. Who knows? It, it'll be a first time thing, world's first. So hopefully that will happen. But she's absolutely beautiful, and her name is Petra. Of course, I think all my snakes are beautiful. Here we have Venus, and on top of her is Mars, 
and Venus is albino lesser, and Mars is albino mahogany lesser. So that'll be a really nice albino clutch. And one thing that I'm hoping to get out of that would be the albino super lesser, which I believe would be a red eye leucistic, or in other words, a white snake with red eyes. So, but anyway, it'll be nice to have some albino stuff. And finally, Banana Mojave Octavius is in the tub with Morticia, my Black Widow. There you see her looking up. And uh, that is going to be a cool, cool pairing, cool clutch, hopefully. And uh, just enjoying all my snakes, of course. Special thanks to Doug Stemmen and Performance Construction as they've insulated the building. Now the next step is boards up on the walls and then we can move the rodents in.